Hi, I'm Joyce Savile from Stressless Property and Wills. Uh, I help you um, plan your legacy for the future. Uh, I'm a property investor and a property lawyer and a trust and estates lawyer. So I understand what it's like to be an investor and uh, the service that you need because you're a property investor. So that's much different um, than a standard person. Um, I'm really sorry I can't be with you tonight. I've got a birthday party to go to. Um, so it is, uh, it is by video. I wish you a really happy Christmas and I hope that you're and, and a prosperous new year and I'll be with you again in the new year. Um, for me, 2021 has been a mixed bag. Uh, I set up with, as a consultant with Nexa Law during 2021 to enable me to offer all you lovely people good property advice. Um, the bad bits are that still the not gone from the pandemic. Uh, my property investment company uh, got stuck in a couple of bits that have caused us a few problems, but they're coming through. Uh, not least a planning issue. Uh, so hopefully in 2021, we will finally get that plan in and be able to move our plot of land on. Um, the achievements, I suppose, uh, that I had in 2021 as part of the good things um, is that I managed to, uh, to get set up, that we uh, got some refurbs done. Uh, we had a we had a some some not good stuff at the beginning of the year. So we, we lost a tenant uh, to COVID um, in the property. So that was difficult. Um, but again, uh, we're still managing to let properties and uh, everything's gone well. Most of our tenants have been able to pay the rent. So I've been really happy with that. Um, during during the year, it's been, a, it's been an interesting year because uh, up until... 2021 I hadn't practiced property in a in in the space I'm I'm practicing now property law uh, so I had have built relationships with lovely people in this community uh, so that I can offer that service but but a different sort of relationship with clients um, which has been been really good um, and to be able to offer bespoke services for property investors, again, uh, made lots of great relationships with people who understand what you need and and, and been able to offer that. Uh, learns, I think, and takeaways from 2021 have been quite different. Um, it's been about keeping your properties full um, and just getting things done, um, you know, trying to build relationships with tradesmen. And I'm sure everybody else is finding that. That's been a good, a bad and, and, and everything in the year because um, tradesmen at the moment are very difficult to find in this area. And I'm sure that's the same in yours. So building relationships with them has been a real takeaway for me uh, from this year. It's not like you can phone somebody up and get them. You have to have a relationship with them to get them to do it. Um, for 2022, um, yeah, for 2022, things are going to be different for me. Um, I'm going to carry on with my, my property law. I'm going to be looking at doing more specialised service. Um, and as our will service, we're really proud to, we're going to be able to offer a service that allows you to ensure that your legacy, your portfolio is actually recorded because if something happens to you, where's all the stuff go? Who knows how to do it? Uh, so we're going to be working with our clients to make sure that they have all those records in the correct place so that if you're ill or you die unexpectedly, then all that information is there so that the legacy you've worked really hard for 
is preserved. So that's new for us in 2022. Um, other things in 2022 is I think we're going to be um, selling some properties to, to, ca to capture the gains we've made on some of those properties uh, so that we can go again. Um, we are moving into development, so we need to finance that. Uh, and there may be more money to be made. And I think that's one of the learns I've learned from this year that sometimes you sell something because you can spend the money better elsewhere. Um, so all remains for me to say to you is have a really, really great Christmas, a happy new year, and I'll see you at the first meeting in 2022. Thanks again. Bye.